Thank you so much for coming to my keynote presentation today. As I've shared with you, I've gone through life and have come up against a lot of different walls. In my experience, I've found that life is filled of, with pieces, pieces of the puzzle that come together at the right time in the right order. I started training at a martial arts school in 2000. At that time, my sensei and I spoke, and during one of our conversations, he said, that what I do is I give you ingredients, and what you do is you learn to bake a cake with that, and that's what I've done through my martial arts training. It's been a slow and arduous process, but I'm glad that I've st stuck with it. During the course of the past 11 or 12 years, I have learned different skills, and I've learned how to combine different skills. Today, I want to just show you a few of those skills. I do this to encourage you to pursue your goals in the ways that work for you. It may be different than martial arts. It may be in some other capacity that is true to your heart. And I want to encourage you to pursue that as in, in terms of ingredients, pieces of the puzzle. And don't worry how they're going to come together. Just keep on working. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you some basic things that I've been working on. What I'm going to show you are pieces of the ingredients that I've learned to place together. When I first started at the martial arts school, I had no idea how to do a correct jab, cross, uppercut, hook, or overhand. So I needed to drill those a lot of times. So there's jab, cross, hook, cover. And then throwing the knees and elbows from the loin side. So what I do is I train both sides of my body so that I can strike with equal power on both sides in coordination. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a combination of the different punches that I've learned how to do to ch channel my brain in different ways so that I can have coordination, eye-hand coordination, agility, hand speed in both of my hands. These are the In this segment, I'm going to be showing you what I've done with the sticks. Sticks are extensions of my hands. What they do is they help me to learn better precision, coordination, hand movement, and speed. So in Kali, there are eight different strikes. Striking is coming here, 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 here here, and then the heart. Same side, the other side. Here, 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 there. That's the basics. And then the left hand. In the uh, use of sticks, there's either single or double stick. I have learned how to combine both sides using the sticks. And I'll proceed now to do that. So it's striking motion, striking motion, striking motion. A friend of mine who is a uh, A3 black belt shared something with me a long time ago that I'd like to share with you. There's no wrong or right way about doing these movements. Martial arts is about learning how to use what works best for you and discarding what doesn't. I'm not in any way saying that I'm an accomplished martial artist because I'm not. I'm saying that I'm on a journey, and I want to encourage you to, to start your journey if you haven't already. And if you are on the journey, you are learning how to combine ingredients, I want to encourage you to keep at it.